Hello, welcome to our daily reflection program, I Got Today. I am Father B.J. Thomas, SVD, a Divine Word Missionary. We live in a world where people are looking forward to an instant happiness and gratification. We seek for instant coffee, instant food, instant solutions to problems, instant end to difficulties, and unfortunately, even an inclination for instant faith life. Our faith or Christianity sometimes get reduced to going to church once in a while, especially on a Sunday or a feast day, saying a few prayers time to time, reading a few verses from Bible and so on, and then expecting instant blessings and favors from God. But is this all that Christ intended from his followers? The gospel of the day is a call to relook at some of the motives and intentions in our following of Christ. To the question of the scribe who said, Teacher, I will follow you wherever you go. Jesus answered, Foxes have dens, the birds of the sky have nests, but the Son of Man has nowhere to rest his head. Jesus does away with any promise of security and comfort. He discourages people from following him for having a better material life. It was not that he didn't want many people, but he wished to purify their motives and intentions and make them authentic in their following him. To follow Jesus is a challenge and a big responsibility. It means renouncing the standards of the world, such as possession, power, pride, and embracing the standards of Jesus and his kingdom, which are poverty, simplicity, and humility. For a Christian, the discipleship to Jesus must be the number one priority. Although we are very much in the world, involved in many activities, we are reminded to keep Christ and his values as the priorities of life. Lord, in the midst of many distractions of the world, help us to get attracted to you. May you be the priority of our life in all our words, actions and intentions. Amen.